Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters, I hope you're well. Allowing alcohol was not enough. Inviting a porn star for a concert was not enough. So Organizing love. swimsuit competitions was not enough. And the secret reintroduction of the pagan goddess Lat in Uzza too was not enough. As far as Vision 2030 is concerned, nothing seems enough for the Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. Now yet again, he's in the news for taking a bizarre and highly disastrous step that could lead to spreading immense corruption in society. Mohammed bin Salman, also known as MBS, is now seeking Hollywood's assistance to develop the regional film industry of Saudi Arabia. There are claims circulating that, in an effort to attract Hollywood and other global filmmakers, the Gulf nation rich in oil has also generously That's offered so incentives, such as a 40% cash refund. In February, it established the $100 million Saudi Film Fund to encourage cooperation with global studios. In addition to drawing in outside producers, Saudi Arabia wants to establish its own industry that represents its customs and values and promotes a culture in which people are free to follow their artistic ambitions. The country is focused on building a bedrock of local filmmakers, but that has to be augmented by having a strong international industry coming to shoot there. But Doctor, I would like to nice go a step further for them to realize that because of the evil that is spread throughout the world, anyone who's not watching serial I would recommend this is haram for you. Don't watch it at all. Please, if you're not if if you're not watching movies because it's haram, if you're not watching serial, my recommendation is read the Quran, it will get you closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Read the hadith, it will get you closer to Allah subhanahu yeah. wa ta'ala. Read the seerah, it will get you closer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But those people who are addicted to movies, there are many Muslims. Millions of Muslims in the world who I know, they're addicted to movies. Yeah. Even if they may not be addicted to the very vulgar movies, they are addicted to the normal Hollywood movies and Bollywood movies, which is a sahara. They may not be watching pornography, but they are watching the normal Bollywood movies in which the ladies are dressed with, 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 uh, with, with skirts and with, with, you know, revealing the body more than covering it. There are music, there are songs away from Islam. So if such a person who is hooked on to the normal Bollywood movie mm. and the normal Hollywood movie or hooked on to the normal serials that you see in the Star TV or the Z TV or, or the other serial and all of them, almost all are haram, this is less haram than the Bollywood movie than the Hollywood movies. Surely there are no love making scenes, they may be a little bit hugging, that's what I'm told. So based on that, if a person is hooked on and he can, best option for people hooked on, stop seeing movies, that's the best. But if he cannot, then seeing such serial like Arthogal is better than seeing the Hollywood and Bollywood serial. Hmm. What I had seen many years back was Message. And the best movie according to me that has been created in the world, any movie, it is Message. Again, the Message movie, which is Arabic is Arrisala. The message movie, it was, uh, the actor was uh, uh, Anthony Quinn. If you ask the fatwa, is it 100% halal? Even the message movie which I saw, I cannot say 100% halal. Hmm. Because there was music. There were sometimes ladies being shown which were not properly dressed. But the way it was created, the way it was made is superb. It will surely get a person close to Islam. But yet, I cannot say 100% halal. But if you want to watch a movie, if you hooked on to a movie, then please watch message the umar series it was a series of 30 episodes made few years earlier it was made uh, by the mbc and funded by the qatar qatar foundation even that i've seen that you cannot say it's 100 percent islamic there was music hmm. there was some scenes of ladies but as far as message is concerned and umar series are concerned the 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 knowledge in it the, the hadith is quoted, the Quran is quoted, it is wonderful. It will surely get a person closer to Islam. There is no obscenity in it. There is not major haram in it. Yes, music is there. And, and Alhamdulillah, as far as Umar series is concerned, majority of the hadith are said, there may be a few here and there, which may be problematic. Yeah. So the best amongst all I would say is, you watch the message movie. If you hooked on to movies. If you are not hooked on to movies, don't watch message. If you hooked on to serial, the best serial to watch is the series of Omar series. Urtugal will not come on the same level as, as, as message. It will not come on the same level as Umar series. But 
let me tell you that suppose there is a lady who is wearing mini skirts and if she says okay i want to wear sharwar kameez but my hair is open is it permissible keeping your hair open is haram but better than wearing mini skirt so i would tell that lady who is wearing mini skirts and deep neck okay stop that wear sharwar kameez which covers your body completely with full sleeve covering your full body except that is seen is your hair so that is multiple times better than even me i said no no yeah. you want to leave mini skirt wear full hijab otherwise don't so this is this will be a foolish answer if you are wearing mini skirt you either wear hijab or continue wearing mini skirt i will tell you okay stop mini skirt wear shalwar kameez cover your full body of course covering your full body and only she showing your hair is a lesser sin as compared to wearing mini skirts and wearing low neck so similarly if those who are hooked on to serials and movies and then if they watch orthogul and orthogul also everything is authentic maybe 20% is authentic but it tries to get a person closer to islam and tries to revive your passion please let me tell you again i have not done a full survey on the orthogul release i am not the app person but what reports i read based on that yes it is haram seeing orthogul is haram but if you are hooked on and if you are watching bollywood movies and if you are watching hollywood movies surely watching this and not watching that is better than not watching this and watching hollywood movies i am very clear instead of watching a hollywood or a bollywood movie i would prefer you stopping it number 1 if you can't stop because you hooked on to serial then watching orthogul is better than watching bollywood and hollywood this in short but yet it is haram but surely it will be a lesser haram as compared to the hollywood and bollywood movies and inshallah this may get you closer to islam and that time and maybe later on you may stop watching all these yeah. haram and then follow and then reading the quran is the best reading the hadith is the best so brothers and sisters i hope you have watched today's video and i hope you like the video of dr zatan night with us dr zatan night always give answers according to quran and hadith and i hope you have watched this video till end So in the first part of today's video we have watched a video which is from Saudi Arabia as you can see in the video this video was published by Sense of Islam in which he told us that Saudi Arabia is going to build its own movie split form as Bollywood and Hollywood are doing as everyone knows that Saudi Arabia is one of the Islamic country and in Muslim it is believed that Saudi Arabia is one of the best Muslim country who follow the rules of Islamic Sharia in the past but new thing of Saudi Arabia is bringing new things which are mostly not according to Islam one of them we have discussed and watch in the video so guys what do you think do you think that saudi arabia should start filming movie as the other country are doing or not please let us know by leaving your comments below and after that we have watched the video of dr zatan night in which dr zatan night told us that what kind of movie we can watch if islam allows us and dr zatan night told us that if a man or woman is addicted to movies then what kind of movies they should watch and some question was asked to dr zatan night that watching islamic movies like artugul khazi umar series and message movie is allowed in islam or not dr zatan night told us according to quran and hadith so that is what dr zatan night says is according to quran and hadith or not please let us know by leaving your comments below and if you are satisfied with the video of dr zatan night then it's our request to you guys please share this video with your friends and family members so they can get benefit from it another request please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so whenever a new video will be published you will get its notification first see you guys in next video till then allah hafiz